happy people. Welcome to Kim Biz Crafts. My name is Kim and if you're new here, hello, welcome. And if you're returning, welcome back guys. Love you, appreciate you returning. And today I have an Amazon haul. <laughs> um, I don't even, okay. I did not just get all this stuff, okay guys? I have been piling up Amazon boxes since December just because of everything that was happening. I just didn't have time. I don't even know what's in half of these boxes anymore. And I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna do one large video. If there's something that just doesn't, like it's just not interesting because I don't, <laughs> I'll just take it out of the video. I'll just take it out. Okay, I won't bore you, but um, I, I don't know what's in these boxes. So it's gonna be like Christmas. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and get into it. Um, and let's just start with this little guy. It's very light. So let's see what's in here. I hope everybody, I hope everybody is having a good day. It is looking like it's going to turn into a nice day. It's a little gloomy out. Oh, the black cat. I'm looking out my window. I didn't know he went back there. What in the world? Are you serious? Wow. And we're talking about recycling and all that. We put this in this box. Why? What? Wow, these are super small. That is not how that they, they looked in the picture. But okay, why would they do that? That is insane. Okay, like why wouldn't they just use a small little envelope? But yeah, okay, I got this in this big box. <laughs> and it's a box of magnets. I got this because there are a couple um, magnets that I have, or mag cover minders, where the magnets fell off. I, I don't even know where the magnets are. So I got this in case that happens. Um, it's one of my favorites from Diamond Art Club too. I, it must have been in my Tom and Jerry because that's the one I'm doing right now. And, um, or maybe it, well, it's not, I don't know. Oh, no, 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 it's not. It, anyway, I'll show you which one I'm talking about. I can't remember where I unboxed it, but yes. I got these little guys. Wow. Okay. These are super strong. I can't even hardly. Okay, so I got these little guys and I just need glue, but they're so thick. I was really trying to find, see, it's, it's very hard in the pictures, isn't it? To figure out which ones to get. Um, where is, this one it's it's from diamond art club and i lost the magnet and i don't know where the magnet is and honestly i could have sworn that they put these up against like a nickel or a quarter and it was equivalent these don't look like a nickel or a quarter like stop i think they sent me the wrong ones but i don't know okay so that was that was all that was in that box Okay, let's see what's in this bag. Oh, yeah. Okay, I actually got this for um, my Diva nail stickers that are not on my nails. This is... This is not how I thought it was gonna be. So I got these for my um, extra Diva nail stickers because I use them and then I have a bunch of extra ones. So I'm gonna have to cut them into sheets and fit them in here. Actually, let me go get them and I'll show you, I'll show you what I mean. Okay, so these are these are what they look like, the dashing divas. And 
this one I have not used. So I have not opened this one and this one I haven't used. So one of these I'm going to be putting on maybe today because I feel like they've cracked enough where I can. But this one I used. And so these are the ones you've seen on me. And these are the leftover ones. And I don't want to throw them out because, well, these I'm going to throw out because these, well, I guess I could cut them in half and use them on my pinky or something. They're huge. I think they're for your toenail. I'm not putting these on my toes though. So I've, I figured let me get something to, instead of keeping all of these boxes, let me get something to keep them in. So for instance, so this was, this was listed as a nail sticker. And honestly, I just thought that this would be like, like the whole sheet so I could just pop these I thought that this would be a whole sheet so I could just pop these strips in here, but I'm gonna have to cut them, which is fine. So I'm gonna cut it like this. This is garbage. these in here. And, and that way when I have like all my leftovers, I can mix and match them. You know what I mean? I can like some of these leftovers and these leftovers, like you can make your own like group of designs. You don't have to follow, like keep them all the same. These are a little hard to get in and out. So yeah, that, that was my plan for these. So then I have all those as an option. This is garbage now. This is just one of, what do they call them? Orange sticks. This is, a, this is all garbage. These are the other ones that I did. Oh, so this, they came with their own little packet, but, uh, and I don't know what this is for. And I did read the directions, <laughs> but so I'm just throwing all that out. And then I'm just going to put these in this one. Yeah, so honestly, I really enjoy, and now I know I'm not going to cut them really small, even if there's only one on there. This comes like this. Just pop that in there. Um, I really like these because I, um, I can't stand going to the nail salon and I can't stand. And, and now that I see how much it's been damaging my nails, like I don't want to go to the nail salon. And this is so much cheaper. Oh, I should have kept a little more of a tab on this one. Yeah. So you see, I could do the mauve and the black now, like even though these are two separate things 
And so I was just gonna keep them all like that. Then I don't have all these boxes and I can reuse previous kits. So that was the concept behind this buy. All right, let's see what's in another bag. Okay, what's in this guy? Sounds like cereal. <laughs> I have ordered, like I ordered cream of rice one time on Amazon because I couldn't find any. Oh yeah, I forgot about this little guy. So I, look how tiny it is. This is a little sewing kit box. And I wanted it for the craft room. I've had the same sewing box. It's been broken, the handle's been broken on it. I can't stand getting it out because it's broken. It's huge, it's bulky. And so this is just a little cute kit to keep on the shelf in here to just do like some, if I have a hole, like I have a hole on one of my sweatpants. These are neat, I like these, okay. Um, measuring tape, and then this lifts up. You got a little sponge here for all your needles, and then you got some threads. Uh, so yeah, I just thought that this would be cute. You, your needles go through here to have on hand, because I couldn't stand getting out that other one to do any kind of sewing, to fix clothes and stuff like that. So just like basic little sewing kit, it's so cute. Okay. Let's see what's in the next. All right, I don't know what's in this big box. This might be the curtains that I'm returning. I hate to open it when I, if I'm not keeping it, but I don't know. I don't... Yeah, I think so, guys. I think that this is, um, cause I, I bought curtains for the craft room and not really digging it, not to mention the fact that they're completely see-through. And yeah, it's basically not having any curtains up. Yeah, so these are going back. I'll put a picture of what they look like hanging. Um, I know that they're lace, and yeah, why would I think they're see-through? But I thought that they would be bunched up enough where they wouldn't be, and that wasn't the case. So I will show you what I mean for the little picture. All right, let's see what's in this box. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I got this for my desk area because I thought I would need it, but honestly, I'm going to use it in a different space of my house but um I think this is really neat so rather than a power strip this has a cord like a power strip does and then you have multiple outlets and then you have USB ports and even like um a phone port here and I wanted to get this for my desk area. I don't think I need it over here because I, I pretty much have everything plugged in and it's not an issue. I do need this in another area of my house. This was not expensive compared to a lot of power strips at like Walmart. I think this was cheaper. I went to Walmart hoping I would see this, something like this and see what the price was. And it was, a, and they didn't even have anything like this with the cord, like this looks pretty long. Um, and they didn't have anything like this. They had those basic power strips and they were more money than this was. So I think this was a really good buy. Okay. All right, let's see what's in this box. Oh, yes. Okay, so these are more. 
these are how um, everybody pretty much uses these to cut their cover sheets. Now I'm doing the washi over the cover sheet. Um, I'm doing what all the cool kids do. And this is a ceramic knife. And I feel like my uh, first one, and I'm still using it, I feel like it's losing a little bit of its sting because my advent calendar had so much to cut through with all of the washi and the stickers that I used that I think it dulled it out very quickly. So I just got these two and yeah, I already put them over there on my desk organizer. Okay, and then this thing. So this thing is looks pretty cool. And this is more printer paper for it. This will pit, will print up small images. And I got this to put stickers on the sides of canvases that don't have pictures. Like Dreamers Designs, they put pictures on the side of their boxes so you can see them but like Diamond Art Club doesn't, and that's why they provide that small sticker. I like to use that small sticker still. So I got this to print up pictures. So we'll actually try that together one day. This is called uh, Faux Memo. And I watched a lot of things and reviews and stuff. And I think it's gonna do what I want it to, so. We'll, we'll play with this together one day. I have to use Bob's phone because you need to download an app and I would need to do that on my phone. So it would be a double phone day. And he happens to be home today. So we'll see. Okay, let's, all right, let's see what, oh, this bag I already opened. Okay, let's see what is in this bag. Great. So two things. Um, I got these clips to uh, my desk top is very thick. And um, there were times when I wanted to like clamp down my canvas in the middle. I was in the middle so I couldn't clamp it on my light pad. And I wanted to clamp it down, but I didn't have anything thick enough to clamp it on my desk. So I got these. And if you're wondering why I like to clamp my canvas down, it's because I, I prefer to not shift while I'm working on it so my drills stay straighter. And so I figured this will be able to clamp on my desk. I don't know. No, I'm going to be out of frame. Let me see. Can you see the edge? Yeah. Okay. Oh. Yeah. So I figured, like, um, if this was my canvas, that I could... I could clamp it. We'll see how it works. So, you know, I can clamp it. <laughs> Slippery suckers. <laughs> Pretty woman. Um, we'll see how this works. But yeah, so that's the premise behind this buy. And then, guy, can you see drills? Yes, I got a little project here. What did I get? I just saw Diamond Painting Jack get something like this. Oh, am I gonna have to rip this bag to get this out? I feel like, how did they get it in? <laughs> how in the world did they get this in here? Because Okay. 
Okay. Coaster set, guys. Oh, these, are these that thick? Okay. So, do they each get a bottom? Oh, they each get a bottom. So, after you diamond paint them, you stick this cork bottom on them. Oh, very nice. And so, this is um, abstract. Hold on, let me move this stuff. These are called abstract landscape. And so these are the coasters I got. How fun are they? Aren't they cute? And um, so they're all, they all get a cork bottom. And I got these, obviously, for my desk. So I've been bringing in, like, drinks with ice in them. And I, would, I have to put a paper towel under them. And I thought this would be a really fun project. I just saw Diamond Painting Jack get a coaster set. And this came with this cute little uh, coaster holder. It's a little misshapen, but that's no big deal. Yeah, there you go. Maybe not. <laughs> yes, okay. And um, yeah, so my plan is to diamond paint these and then coat them with a sealant and yeah, use it as coasters. I think they're really pretty. They had so many different ones they have. And I figured like, if I really enjoyed this project, you could get seasonal ones. They have holiday ones. That would be fun to have like a coaster collection. They had Valentine's Day ones. Like, so February, I could pull those out. I just thought it was a really cute idea, but I wanted to just get um, like everyday ones to start and see what I thought. And These are the drills. Um, so let's see, is there a sheet? Okay, so I'm seeing something here. <laughs> There's no sheet, but they put on here. Seven is the code. So you see it's a green and the green sky is seven. So um, you would just have to put the code down and then I don't, I, they're not, they're, they do not give you, so you would not keep these. Um, they do not give you a DMC because they all say BD131. So that must mean that these are, that's the project identification. So BD131, so you don't know what the DMC numbers are. So that just puts the code, the legend, and then the project ID. So yeah. And then they give you just a basic toolkit. I think it's gonna be fun. Okay. 
All right, let's see what's in here. I was cutting more than just, and I was. What in the world? Okay. T-shirts. I, I, I did get one for my son, didn't I? This is a large. I got this for my son. If you watch anime, you would recognize this this picture. This is Monkey D. Luffy, and um, Luffy, or also known as Luffy, and he's from the anime cartoon One Piece. And I've I've been enjoying wearing large T-shirts at the gym, and so I've been wearing a lot of Bob's T-shirts, and I decided to get myself um, a t-shirt it's a shame I just saw my son for his birthday and I actually got myself the extra large but I'll let him choose this is probably this is too big for him I like having extra big so yeah super cute All right. All right, guys, that was my Amazon haul. We got a set of diamond painting coasters. I got this little digital printer and this uses, um, what did they say? So you don't need ink for this. This uses like a laser printing. What is it called? Um, you don't need ink, you just need um, printer paper, this printer paper. Um, let's open it up. this is what it looks like and yeah it's just like this and you download an app for it and you can see you just you cut the the paper off so here's the paper and you don't need toner or anything and it's a sticker, so I got the adhesives. I haven't read anything yet, so I'm not gonna do anything crazy. But yeah, you pull, pull it out and then go like this and rip it off. And then there are stickers, so I can stick it on the side of my boxes. So I know what painting I'm looking at. So I'm gonna go ahead and plug this in. And then, yeah, hopefully we'll be doing a little tutorial on this. It says, so this plugs here, and then see this, if I had this plugged in on the side of my desk, I could just plug it in here and that's how it would charge up. That's weird, this does not, um, go in all the way. It feels weird. Is it supposed to? There we go. Yeah, that looks better. And yeah, so I got extra paper. And then I got this cute little sewing kit. 
just to do, and it has a button on here, that's the idea. And then the seam of one of my sweatpants is coming apart, so this is gonna be good to do that. And I got this power strip box and these clips. Oh yeah, and my nail sticker book. And that's all I have for you guys. That's my Amazon haul. A lot of this stuff has been hanging around for over a month. Uh, but I wanted to record it for you and show you what I got. So if you enjoyed this video, if you guys wouldn't mind giving me a thumbs up on the way out. And if you want to see more from me, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and join the family and friends here at Canvas Crafts. I would love to have you. You guys have a wonderful, wonderful day. Take care. Keep diamond painting.